Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for the Virgo Sun, Moon and Rising Sign. It is the 4th week of August 2017. We have one more week to go. The week begins from the 21st until the 27th. In this week of August, it is the beginning from the zodiac energy vibration for the year 2017 for you Virgos because it's time for you Virgos to begin to start having your birthday your um 2017 um year begins after your birthday so on wednesday is the 27th of August and on Wednesday the 27th of August that is the time that you Virgos will be starting with the year 2017 for you Virgos okay so what is happening in this week is that we have the two first days and Mondays and Tuesday we have the energy vibration of the fire energy so you will have to be finding your inner passion for some people and some people will be working with the energy vibration of a fire so be aware of what is happening in your life in this week because this week is going to be a positive week you have the energy vibration of the nine of cups your wishes and dreams are coming true you have the energy vibration of the magician which is the energy vibration of the year so as I've always said um, to you Virgos your um, luck is coming in very slow very slow you know some people luck comes in like the wheel of fortune Whoa and then that's it but your luck comes in slowly and it stays with you Virgos and this year is going to be a very positive year for you Virgos as I'm looking at your week you have a lot of emotional situation but it's not it's good emotion it's good emotion because your energy vibration of the week is the nine of Pent nine of cups which the energy vibration of the nine of cups is your wishes and dreams are coming true so the number nine is your energy vibration which is so positive let me just put my glasses on the number nine is your energy vibration for this week and uh, you have the nine of cups and the nine of pentacles so congratulations to you Virgos. it's going to be a wonderful week what is happening is that you have a situation with the king of swords and the princess of pentacles be aware of the situation you have um two major arcana and that is the moon and the magician whatever is happening with these major arcana you have the moon and the magician that is working in your favor in this week your week is a positive week behalf of the princess of cups the king of swords and the princess of one so be aware and see who these people are and as i do a multiple day you will know um what's happening for you virgos let me see what are the messages are coming in for you virgos and this fourth week of august what are the messages are here for you virgos okay your focus in this week is the seven of pentacles in reverse which is good whenever the seven of pentacles is in reverse this is a good sign because what it's saying is that whatever is there that you have worked on whatever is supposed to come to you is going to come to you it doesn't matter what how and when it is going to come to you so be aware of the situation whatever that is happening in your life it's going to be resolved okay financial wise as we look at your week we have the the moon twice oh my god I've been saying it to you guys um, that double doubles are coming up so there is a significant lesson there is a lot of people you'll be working with a lot of people um, uh, the knight of come the prince of uh, uh, of of the prince You'll be working with people between the ages of 18 and 35. There's a lot of this coming up. Your own self is in the reading on Friday. And whatever is happening with you, Virgos, you have the energy vibration of the princess of Wands. The energy of the princess of Wands is a Aries, a Leo, or a Sagittarius. Whoever this could be, um, some of you children, if you have um, kids that... Or fire sign and this is the energy vibration of 
whoever this person is is the energy of the princess of wands okay so be aware of what is happening as we look here we have the energy of the seven so you have nine and seven as your energy vibration number and this is so good because this is what I've been showing you guys that there's so many doubles coming up you have the seven of Pentacles in reverse, the seven of pentacles in reverse twice. Whatever the situation is, you have the energy of the seven of twenty um, pentacles coming up twice in your reading. Whatever negative energy is about your financial situation, it's going to be better. So this is good, okay? As we move forward, we have another double in this week, and it's the moon twice. So for some people, it's going to be a positive energy on Monday. Some people, your intuition is going to be extremely high. It's going to be clear. Um, your guides and angels are going to be uh, protecting you. For some people, the energy of um, um, other people, your enemies are coming out of the woodwork. The enemies, you can see you know you're looking down and you're realizing you're seeing your enemy approaching you slowly but surely it's as if they're coming look at this uh, crab coming out uh, or this uh, scorpion coming out of this hole and these ounces are coming up but they can't reach you they can't reach you whoever these people are your enemies because these are enemies that are coming out if you look at the scorpion it's coming out of a huge hole that it has dug for itself and it's trying to um, um, climb out of it and you have these two um, dogs that is trying to reach the moon but you know you are so spiritually protected that these little enemies they can growl because the, the dogs are growling at the moon but they can't reach it you know it's looking down at you and said really seriously so whoever these people are be aware of them and they can be um the, the these are enemies that are close by to you it could they, these are people who could be living near to you or their friends to you or that sort of a thing because your best friend is always your worst enemies and especially people who live in your apartment complex with people who are your neighbors and that sort of a thing so look out for this somehow someone has dig a hole for someone and they themselves has fall in it so be aware so for some people you're going to see the intuition by connecting with your guides and angel understanding um, what is happening they're going to show you your enemies okay and there's for some people be careful who you are because there are two people here who you live in the same apartment building or the same complex or you know the, your neighbors be aware of them because you know they're growling at you but they can't reach you they can't touch you okay there was one who tried to did something to you and they fall in uh, the same all that they have dig for you so be aware so anyway on Monday is going to be a super super positive day it is the energy of uh, the intuition the spirit guides and angels coming up to show you something so you know no matter what is happening and people are trying to dig a hole for you they themselves is going to fall in it as we move forward on Tuesday we have the energy of the magician which is the energy of the of the the um, the year for you um, Virgos this is good because the energy of the year 2017 is the energy of the magician you're just about to start your 2007 journey for the um, year 2017 because it will end on the 22nd of August next year okay so you Virgos are about to start the new year and for the men it's going to be very positive so you Virgo men who were born um, uh, after the 23rd of August or on the 23rd of August until um, the 22nd of September it's going to be a wonderful year the year 2017 is going to bring you a lot of magical situations so look out for you Virgo men after your birthday in this year 2017 are wonderful things are going to be happening for you men as we move on we have 
um, happiness is the crown in the nine of cups happiness is the crown in the nine of cups for you um, Virgos for this week so it's a positive week so it's all about achievement happiness joy your wishes and dreams are coming true for this week and a lot of people will be seeing that with people really um, letting you know how um, wonderful and how good um, they are feeling from just the things that you're doing for them and this is going to be very positive so this is a good time this is a positive time so enjoy this week you Virgos on Thursday whatever is happening you have a situation you Virgos with uh, a Libran a Virgo a Libran Gemini or a Aquarius whoever because you guys are so many thousands of you people and you guys will be working some of you will be working out a situation with an Aquarius man some of you are women or woman some of you will be working out a situation with an with an and an, 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 um, a Virgo or a Gemini person so you Virgos are working with the Aquarians the the Aquarians Gemini or Libran so you could be working with any of the three or all of the three whatever the situation is on Thursday um, they this person wants to apologize for something this person wants to apologize for something um, open up yourself and you can listen to the apology accept the apology forgiveness is the key um, whoever this person is is very sorry for what they have done and they're asking for forgiveness forgive them because they come with a cup of water asking for forgiveness whatever this is this is a healing so whoever this person was um, they're asking for a healing so accept the apologies and whatever as I've said each day in a week I've realized that each day in a week is the healing comes in either love or healing someone who is an Aquarius a, um, a Libran or a Gemini is coming and asking for your forgiveness for a gift for that person whoever they are as we move forward on Friday we have the energy vibration of the princess of wands so on Friday you're going to have a situation with a fire sign person and you need to give her money or lend her money this could be a situation with your mom whatever the situation is this could be a situation with your daughter that you need to help her with a situation help her out with a situation on Friday be open to this person whatever the situation is try and see how you can help this person and resolve whatever the situation is okay so you have the energy vibration of uh, this fire sign person's uh, Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius and you it could be your daughter and some it could be your mom some this is an energy vibration of a young person whatever is happening you need to think that love and try and help out whatever the situation is as we look to Friday we have the energy vibration Saturday I'm sorry um, as we look to Saturday we have the energy vibration of the princess of cups whoever this person is this princess of cups on Saturday you are going to have an energy vibration of the seven of Pentacles in reverse this is twice you um, Virgos are having the seven of Pentacles so seven and nine is your energy vibration in this week whatever is happening the seven of Pentacles is in the reverse form so it has to do with someone who is between is a Pisces a cancer or a scorpion between the ages of 18 and 35 you have a situation that has to do with money you could have lend this person of money and you realize that you're not going to receive the money back whatever the situation is this person is vibrating with this um, energy of uh, the princess of cups have a situation that she needs to work out with you with a financial situation on Saturday it could be that you're going out with this person shopping having something to drink or whatever you realize that you know this person doesn't have any money uh, help out the situation 
because on Sunday you have the energy of the nine of Pentacles which is wonderful the nine of Pentacles is coming with a new beginning a new endeavor whatever you were working on this you are going to be a success okay so money is going to come into you and it's gonna come in so your wishes and dreams whatever endeavor do you have that you were working on whatever groups you were in and you were trying to get something off the ground you are going to realize that on Sunday it's going to happen and money is going to come in your life the energy of the three of um, three of ones is a zero is a very positive energy where you're going to realize that your gain in the financial world is going to come in and it's good for you Virgos because it's the beginning of uh, your energy vibration of the year 2017 something is happening for you earth sign people because I also see that the the Tauruses had also the nine the ten of Pentacles so a lot of money gaining of money the the the, the, the earth is healing uh, you guys and helping you guys and this is why I've always said to people call upon your angels and guides because they will come in and help you as I look at the energy vibration of this week it is a week of happiness for you guys whatever is happening it's a week of your wishes and dreams are coming through on Tuesday someone who is an Aquarius a Libra or a um, Gemini is coming to apologize to you for whatever the situation is whatever that has pale um, accept the apologies whatever it is whoever it is so it can be an Aquarius it can be a Gemini or it can be a Libra on a Saturday you will have a something that has to do with money with someone who is the princess of cups whoever this princess of cups is there's going to be a situation that needs to be healed and it has to do with a monetary situation love is not really one of the foremost thing is happiness and joy with yourself a lot of healing is coming in a lot of love is going to come in um, in the sense of of people are going to be opening up their self and showing them how much they care about you so we're working with the chakra cards and let's see what's happening we have recovery this is second time recovery not this energy but recovery is coming out so a lot of you earth signs are going to be recovering especially for you Virgos who are having birthday in this year so this is wonderful and a miracle is going to happen because recovery and with that recovery a miracle is going to come in for you guys so it's going to be wonderful whatever that is so whenever the energy of recovery comes up it means that you're ill in a situation that has been happening in your life and let's go forward to see if you have any um, question in this week what is the answer to the Virgos question of the fourth week of August let's see what is coming in you are ready you are ready so this is is is, is this is this is incredible this is wonderful forgiveness is going to be um a lot of you need to forgive this person whoever this person is coming in and what of whatever way to apologize to you on Thursday you need to have forgiveness and accept the apology the apology is going to come in from someone who is an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libra accept the apology and ask that whatever the situation was been yield okay your answer to this question that you asked is that you are ready all your present experience have led you to this moment you have studied and grown spiritually in many ways there is nothing more to do you are ready are ready to move on forward and to embrace the person you know in your heart you were meant to be so yes in other words it's a yes you already so whatever question you had asked it's a yes I want to say to each and every person remember to um, listen to the monthly reading and I want to say thank you for being here please thumbs up like and share these videos and I'll speak to you next week yeah.